Okay, good morning. Lisa and Landon. Landon is fixing some omelets over here. We're in a small spot, so I'm beside him so we can do it together. He's fixing the omelets in their um, commercial grade uh, stainless 12 inch skillet over here. He's making some omelets with our farm fresh eggs. And I'm going to be using the waffle stick pan. A lot of people have wondered, but you know, they think just because it's only three whales in here that it's not a lot for breakfast. Each one of these sticks is equal to about two good fluffy pancakes. So for us, I used it the other weekend and we had leftovers. It, and it's three of us eating and we did not eat them all. So the recipe is on the site for this pan. So the first thing I'm going to do is use my brush and just brush the wells. We love having chickens here because we always have eggs. Our chickens lay brown eggs and they are excellent to cook with. There's nothing like fresh eggs. I think they rise better, they taste richer, and you know where they're coming from. They're coming from your backyard. All right, so I just brushed, brushed the oil in. So now we're gonna make our batter. And I'm going to use my silicone um, measuring prep bowls. They're actually, they come in a set of three, three cup down to one cup, and they even come with lids. They're freezer safe, microwave safe, even oven safe because of the, the silicone. So I love using these. And to make your batter, because they're silicone, they do have a pour spout. It's easy to, to get that batter in there. So I'm going to take my flour. I've already pre-measured that in my little cup. I like that with the plunger you get all that out for the dry ingredient and then other end I'm using for my liquid all right so now we need our sugar we need three tablespoons of sugar but I just have my half tablespoon out Our uh, measuring spoons if you get this version they nest and click together so you don't lose them in the drawer they click together And again, normally that would be three tablespoons, but I'm using my half, so I had to do six. We're going to need a tablespoon of baking powder. And yes, I'm doing these from scratch because I always keep my staple ingredients and it's so easy. I don't buy a lot of times like a baking mix, like for your pancakes or waffles, because it's just simple just to keep general everyday um pantry items like this and make stuff from scratch and it's just simple all right so i need a quarter of a teaspoon of salt and a half a cup of milk so again i'm using this one side i used for um my dry ingredient now I just flip it the other side and i'm gonna use it for my liquid So that was a half a cup of milk. Now I need my two eggs. I'm gonna use my farm fresh butt naked, my pet's poop breakfast. <laughs> Do you have the whisk over there or is it over here in the dishwasher? Landon is rocking out on the non-stick skillet over here. He is doing four egg loaded omelets while I'm doing this. And then I just need a teaspoon of vanilla. And I'm just going to whisk this together and pour it in my wells. And they're going to cook for about 10 minutes in a 400 degree oven.
And again, you can see I literally only dirtied up like two or three things to make this because everything is versatile. So I didn't need a batter bowl because I'm using my prep bowl. Then my prep bowl, I don't have to use anything to dip out of it to put it in here because it has the pour spout. My measuring cup is dual purpose. One side is dry ingredient. The other side is liquid. But, all right, Landon, can you tilt that up a little bit? Let everybody see. Look at those big omelets. I love these pans. Um, Air products are not really any more expensive than the good quality-ish, quality-ish products in the big box stores. The thing with theirs is you get a 30-day money-back guarantee. You get a consultant to help and answer questions whenever. And some of these products have anywhere from a one, three, or lifetime warranty. And with Paper Chef, if you ever have to send something back, they pay the return postage, and it's not hassle. It's a phone call or an email, and you're done and taken care of. All right, so I'm just going to fill my wells up here. Let's see, I'm going to use my pouring spout, but sometimes I'm a little messy. One, two, Be sure to check our page out, our VIP cooking page often. If you're not a member, just uh, give us a shout out. I'll add you to it. I've always got something going on. We do monthly giveaways and prizes. Landon and I and my team and Michael, everybody work together and we um, become a director team last month. So now I'm actually a director and I'm trying to move on. To uh, advanced director. So there's there's my six feet, not a mess, no dripping. So I'm gonna put it over here in my preheated oven for about 10 minutes. Lena's gonna keep rocking out the omelets, and I'm gonna make some homemade syrup, which is super super simple. We don't keep maple syrup around, but basically that's super simple too. And I will post a picture alongside with this video of our finished product. Thanks for watching. You did a good job.